Let me guess, you're new to fitness and you're currently online looking for the best new workout equipment to invest in whilst you're stuck in our current predicament. In this video, I'm gonna share with you the number one best piece of home equipment you can buy that's inexpensive, where you can buy that from, and also a workout that will go through with you guys so you don't even know how to use it at home. So if you haven't guessed it yet, the equipment I'm talking about is these bad boys. Resistance bands. Why is a resistant band so good as a home workout? There is about 100, 100 plus exercises you can do with this thing alone, with you and your body. And trust me, they ain't easy. Beginners and also advanced people. So I'm gonna show you today so you don't buy the wrong bands because there is different kind of ones. There's really thin ones that snap and hit you right in the face. Trust me, you do not wanna buy that band save you a lot of pain, time, and money. So which one should you buy? <laughs> Glad you asked. Down below in this video is a link of ones I would recommend. They look very similar to this. So they're very, very thick, which you will see in that link below is only 15 pounds. Hopefully, if you haven't already, there's people out there spending 100, 200, 300 pounds on home equipment, proper benches, barbells, dumbbells, everything you can, you can name, a little mini gym, which I'm not saying is bad by any means. But long term, I'm, I'm telling you, they're gonna have all this stuff either stuck in a garage or some storage they have to put it in. Whereas this, 15 pounds, and you can literally just like, oh, put that in my sleeve, you know? You can wear it as a bandana. You don't have to store it anywhere. It's easy as that. So I know what you're thinking. Blaine, I don't have 15 pounds to spend on one of these things. Kind of having a, a financial crisis right now. <laughs> 15 pounds, I don't really want to put towards a home workout piece of equipment. Say no more, okay? If that is something you're thinking and you haven't found a good workout yet, I will be posting a workout with no equipment at all that you can go through with myself and we'll do that together. This will be a full body workout and that'll be my next video come up and coming. I will tell you not to slack off, all right? Because in my previous video, I show you how to lose weight without actually exercising. Okay, so let's say you've bought your band, okay? Let's say you've bought your band. If you actually have a band already, congratulations, and you know the benefits. I mean, come on, they're good. I'm about to go through the exercise with you on this, uh, on my laptop here. So if I am looking away, you know why. Four sets to 10 reps on each one. Do two sets uh, far, slow and focused and then two sets fast, and you can superset these as well. If you don't want to, you can do one at each time. It should take you between 45 minutes to an hour to do this workout. So, okay, so first exercise, resistant band squat. Okay, so you see in the video here, keeping my arms straight, back straight, similar, exactly the same as normal squat, but I'm holding my hands on the band underneath my feet, which will create that resistance. Now, a lot of people might say, oh, I squat loads of, uh, quite a lot of weight. I'm telling you, if you wrap it up in your hands, which you'll see in the video, it will give you that enough resistance to actually work, give you a decent workout. Okay, so with this one here as well, you can superset these two together. This is for your hamstrings. So by the way, superset, you just basically go from straight into that one and then sit up straight into this one. There obviously will be a little bit of faff in between, but the shorter time you can put them together, the better the workout will be. I and mean, it really increased intensity. Put it under one foot um, and I had to wrap it two or three times with this particular band to give me enough uh, resistance to give me a good workout on that one. Go nice and slow on the first two sets. Nice and slow, focus on the movement and then the, the last two sets of each ex exercise, you can do this across the board, speed it up, make it go fast but controlled and you'll feel the burn, trust me. <clears throat> Okay, moving on to the chest exercise, which would be representing basically the chest chest press, but with a resistance band. Just wrap it behind your back, as you can see, keeping that band across your arms there. It's as simple as that, okay? Very easy. Next exercise, which is, you, again, you can superset this with it as well. This is focusing on your back, putting the resistance band underneath your feet and driving it up into a row. So you're driving your elbows back into a row. Really squeeze it for a second, like you can see at the top. Change angle here so you can make sure you're doing it right. Keep those elbows tight to your hips, as you see here. Just drive them back. And you can put, you put your hands however you want to, more comfortable for yourself. 
Moving on to arms. So you can got your biceps and triceps. Again, you can superset these showing your biceps right here. So you're just putting the band in your palm like so and curling it up towards your head. Just like a simple curl you'd normally do in the gym. Okay, very easy and simple. And again, if you want to make it a bit harder, just wrap it around your hand and you will definitely feel a difference for sure. Or even widen your feet as well. And then the tricep exercise here, which is just going over the top of your head, keeping the elbows still and just bending your hands back behind your head. Okay, so you're putting the band all the way around your under your feet again, just extending your arms. And it's very similar to this exercise, which is this shoulder exercise. It's very similar to a shoulder press. All you have to do is put the band underneath your feet and just press it over your head. What are you doing? Okay, so yeah, so that's the last exercise I'll be showing you. And that is a complete workout for your body with a resistant band. And it's in the very good exercises you would normally use in the gym. You might even feel new gains as well. But trust me, it'll give you a great workout for just 15 pounds. And now I'm showing you just to clarify ways that you can make it harder. So if you put your feet in, it makes it easier for yourself. Or if you widen your feet, this will make it a lot harder as well. You, it'll, it'll basically make it harder, a, a more resistance um, because you're stretching out the band. And then again, you can just wrap your hand around it to make sure, and if, even if you want to, widen your feet as well as wrap around your hand will make it very, very hard for you. Okay, and there you go. And that is why the resistant band is such a great tool. Okay, there's not a lot of things you can do out there, get a whole body workout. Now I can understand if, if you don't have time to do this or the money to buy the bands, then you can watch my previous video here, which shows you how to lose weight without exercise, giving you 10 tips on how to achieve that. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button down below and comment if you've got any questions, I'll be sure to answer them for you. If you wanna see more videos like this on my channel, then hit the subscribe button below. Don't forget to hit the notification bell, I'll show you as soon as that video comes out. Discussion topic. Mm-hmm.